actually launching what date? June 24th, Wednesday June. morning. And again, it's a free service. I, I haven't seen anything here where you've asked for money. What's, what's the business model here? Why is Microsoft actually doing this? Apart from it being a great tool and, and a great service. Yeah. In the short term, the business model is really around targeted advertising. Sure. So as, as homeowners try and find out about new products or services, you know, we'll use the conventional web business model of click-through advertising that if we refer someone over to a, a product or service vendor, we'll receive a, a referral fee for that. Longer term, as we really scale up the business towards our 10-year vision of really making the home energy consumption responsive to the availability of energy on the supply side, we'll have products and services that we sell directly to utilities. Right. And at a high level, the issue there is as these big coal power plants get replaced with less consistent energy generation sources like solar and wind, you need a way to stimulate consumption when electricity is cheap and plentiful and curtail consumption when it's scarce and expensive. Right. Simply because electricity cannot today be stored at scale. It's not efficient to store it. Mm -hmm. So if it's if it's freely available or plentiful rather, you want to use it while it's there. And tools like home will allow the homeowner to use electricity when it's cheap and scale back their usage when it becomes expensive. So long term I think that's really becomes our primary business model. And also, I think you, you mentioned before we started rolling the cameras, is that Microsoft Home is running on the Azure platform. Is that correct? It is. So a lot of the complexity that, that, that I mentioned in terms of the analytics, walking through each hour of each day and simulating the home under different weather conditions, requires a lot of computational resources. So we use the, the, the really the fantastic features of the Azure Cloud operating system to distribute those worker threads, to do those different modeling uh, process jobs so that we can scale effectively across our broad set of users. This isn't a problem that, that really is suitable to a conventional web server model. You need to be able to quickly scale up or scale down computational resources to do that type of, of analytic. Cool, so I suppose Microsoft Home for um, you know anyone out there that is contemplating trying Azure or actually using Azure as part of a business model, this becomes a fantastic example of what you can do with it. It, it really does and you know we're excited to be working with the Azure team. They, they really helped us solve some tough uh, computational problems and as a result we're able to offer what we think is a good ex experience to homeowners free of charge. That's fantastic. So two elements to it, let's just quickly recap. Um, I put in some, if I want, very simple information about my house and where I live. Mm -hmm. and if you want, you said 200 questions, you can actually dive down in to be you more could, specific? Yep, you can go as deep as you want on any of those questions. So if you think you have a particularly special home with special situations with, with windows or with heating or whatever, you can tunnel down into those questions and, and change the system defaults so that it's more reflective of your situation. Or you can choose not to. You can choose to say, yeah, I'm just going to go with the system defaults and, and see what it gives me. We're, again, we're going to let the, the consumer determine how much or how little information they want to provide. Sure. So the first part is entering the information about your home. The second part is either connecting up with your utility provider or manually entering that data if it doesn't exist. Correct. And from there, the service is going to give you options and recommendations on how you can save money. Yep. Save money and save on your your impact to the environment through reduced carbon emissions. And I suppose also the inverse would work as well and by that I mean if you do make a change to your household, maybe you buy a new refrigerator, maybe you plug in a new television and you can actually see an increase in energy usage, that can help you say, oh I actually you know, need to make a change here to, to, to reduce my energy consumption. Exactly. That's fantastic. Yeah. And then just very quickly, I'd like to end on that, that graph you've got a little bit down where it shows the average house in your area. Mm -hmm. um, because even just here in, in Redmond where you mentioned that electricity is, or Washington State, where electricity is relatively cheap, you still have the opportunity there by making changes that Microsoft Home will recommend of saving hundreds if not thousands of dollars over you know a 12 month period. That's, That's correct. real money. It is. That's not like you know five cents or 20 cents. It's actually real money. It's real money and let's face it, uh, energy bills are, are going to get more expensive over the next couple of years yeah. as some of these new policies kick in and require more uh, uh, carbon free energy sources. So the price of energy is only going to go north over time and get going now on driving energy efficiency in your home so that you save even more money. Now you mentioned before uh, United States 
will be the country that's launched first. Correct. Um, do you want to briefly, just quickly mention on some of the other countries you're, you're thinking about launching internationally? Yeah, you know, clearly we want to make the tool available to as many countries as we possibly can. But on our short list for, for the, 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 probably the next year, uh, Germany, the UK, France, Australia and Canada are really kind of at the top of our list currently. Great. But, uh, you know, India and China and Japan and so forth, really all of the major countries in the U.S., we, we want to provide a great experience for energy management. Fantastic. All right. The URL is Microsoft Home, H-O-H-M dot com. Go there, sign up, save money, be green. Troy, thanks for joining us. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers.